I know that this is last minute, but can I bring a date to the wedding? He's really cute. <gasps> Does he have a brother? Ooh, force a habit. I gotta stop that. <laughs> sure, sweetie. Ooh, that Sammy's grandson, the future star of your father's new musical, thanks to me, but I don't want to toot my own horn. Beep, beep! <laughs> Sammy, I didn't know you were coming. Well, somebody had to drive her in. <laughs> well, where is he? Uh Hi, I'm Irwin. Hi, I'm scared. <laughs> Do you always dress that way to sing, or, or were you just audited? <laughs> I don't sing, and I don't make enough to get audited. <laughs> What do you mean you don't sing? Your grandfather told me that you're a great rapper. Oh, I'm the best. I'm the best. Oh, oh. Got scotch tape, paper, and a ribbon? <laughs> you're a gift rapper? <laughs> Sammy, why did you tell me that he rapped for Puff Daddy? Well, he did last Christmas. <laughs> Puff likes lots of bowls in those little plastic Santas. And oh, oh, yes! <laughs> You tell your grandfather that you wanted to work on Broadway. Well, I live on 8th Avenue. I figured I could just walk. I mean, do you realize that Mr. Sheffield has one of the most important composers on Broadway coming here to listen to a gift wrapper from Creighton Barrow? Pottery Barn. He was first. Oh, look, it's not the first time that I've screwed up. What's he gonna do? Take back the ring? <gasps> Give me something salty. I'll bloat. He'll never get this ring off. <laughs> Listen, I, I don't want to ruin everything for you. You know, maybe this is a blessing in disguise. I don't want to be a gift rapper all my life. Maybe I do have some talent. You know, my granddaddy, he plays the piano and sings great. Oh, stop you making me blush. <laughs> Just let me try. OK, well, what have I got to lose? Try. Really hard. <laughs> home, home on the range, where the deer and the antelope play. <laughs> Who's that? Irwin. Miss Fine! Oh, 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 oh I'm Mr. Sheffield. Um, uh, uh, you know what? I was just thinking. Rap is dead. What are you talking about? It's the hottest thing on Broadway. Oh, oh, well, then it must be me that's dead. <laughs> uh, would you excuse us a minute, please? Oh. I want to see you in my office. Oh, get something salty. Salty pretzels! <laughs> Where did you meet the mother? <laughs> I have a very important composer coming to this house in less than 24 hours expecting to meet Puff Daddy's protege. Well, I never said protege. That was your embellishment. Bye now. Miss Fine! You're calling me Miss Fine? That can't be a good thing. Oh, it's not. Trust me. Why did I listen to you? Why, why did I think things were going to be different just because we got engaged? Well, first of all, we are still engaged, aren't we? <laughs> oh, now, home, home on the range happens to be a very complicated number. That does not mean he isn't an excellent rapper. So why don't you stop adding gray to that beautiful henna hair of yours? He does rap. Hmm? You're not patronizing me? No, babe. <laughs> now I can look you straight in the eyes and say, Irwin is one professional rapper. Yes, a gift rapper for Crate and Barrel. Is that true? No, it is not. Pottery Bond, they were first. 